Assalamualaikum semuanya Kata-kata human shield atau tamang hidup sering digunakan oleh Israel sebagai alasan menyerang jalur Gaza Menurut pemerintah negara Zionis itu, milisi Hamas menggunakan warga Gaza sebagai tamang untuk bersembunyi Seorang jurnalis Amerika Serikat bernama Abby Martin mengungkapkan alasan mengapa tuduhan Israel dan negara-negara barat itu sebenarnya hanyalah alasan yang dibuat-buat. If everyone in Gaza is a legitimate human shield, that's only because of Israel's own design. This is a situation of Israel's own making. Israel drew the borders and Israel refuses to let anyone leave. To leave Gaza, you must get approval from the Israeli government. And the government will almost always say no. So what are people supposed to do who want to remove themselves from the carnage? They have literally nowhere to run and nowhere to hide. Israel has made Gaza, in every sense of the term, an open-air prison. They trap two million civilians in this tiny strip of land. Then they bomb their neighborhoods and say, well, they shouldn't have been there. The mountain of civilian dead has to be looked at through the perspective of the Israeli blockade and the inability of anyone to escape. Resistance forces in Gaza have nowhere else to go to. Gaza's self-defense capabilities are confined to this heavily populated area. And Israel has intentionally made Gaza unlivable. The only way Gaza is able to exert pressure on Israel is by firing rockets. If they peacefully protest their conditions, they're massacred just the same. If they do nothing, Israel continues to blockade them. And that in turn becomes the excuse for Israel massacring so-called human shields. It's far from the first time this term has been used to state-sponsored mass slaughter. Human shield propaganda has been long applied by the empire to dehumanize the enemy in nearly every major world conflict or war, from its atrocities in Korea to Iraq. And it always serves the same purpose, to dehumanize entire populations, giving the perpetrators a free pass to act with total disregard for civilian life. Jurnalis independen Abby Martin dikenal sebagai jurnalis yang sangat kritis terhadap kebijakan politik Amerika Serikat dan sekutunya di berbagai belahan dunia. Ia juga dikenal sebagai jurnalis sekaligus aktivis pro-Palestina.